Hello, I'm Colonel John Sanis, the commander of the 7th Special Forces Group. Thank you for joining me this Memorial Day. Memorial Day is a day of national awareness and solemn reverence. A day for us to honor the military men and women who gave their lives in defense of our nation, its values, our freedoms, and our liberties. As we move into this Memorial Day after an unusual year, I ask that you take this time to reflect on those military men and women who made the ultimate sacrifice to this country. Memorial Day was first observed after the Civil War and called Decoration Day because families typically remembered their loved ones by decorating grave sites with flowers or flags. We still do that across America today at 171 national cemeteries, numerous state and local cemeteries, as well as 26 permanent American military cemeteries and 32 federal memorials, monuments, and markers across the world. Since 2001, over 50,000 American service members have been wounded and more than 7,000 service members have been killed in action. Today, we recognize those who gave their lives and honor their ultimate sacrifice and the sacrifices of their Gold Star families, friends, and teammates. And we reaffirm our devout commitment to selfless service. At this time, I'd like to have a moment of silence to honor the 68 warriors from the 7th Special Forces Group that have paid the ultimate sacrifice.